And my son's name is uh, Michael Nathan Twining. He went by Nate, his kids called him Nate the Great. He served in Iraq and Afghanistan, three and a half tours. He wanted something great. You know, my son survived the war, but he didn't survive so good after the war. Came back with brain cancer from exposure. They found it while he's a drill sergeant. He introduced me to the Fisher House after a, a stay there. And um, I was tired, I didn't want to go. I said, no, let's just go home, Nate. He said, no, you're going in there to meet these people. And so I did, and I'm glad I did, it changed my life. We stayed at Fisher House for two and a half years. Fisher House gave my son a life of dignity right till the end, you know. And he knew that they were taking care of me, which was very important for him. He worried more about me than him. That's him on the shirt. That was his last duty station. Sergeant Major F. Michael Klein. Champions for Heroes is the Michael Nathan Twining Foundation. And we unite world boxing champions with our military veterans, wherever they may be, Las Vegas or Chicago. Thank you for honoring us, you know, so thank you. And these world champions, they're, they're in this. Not one has turned me down. They, they love the veterans. It's more like a family reunion than anything else. And it, they are family when they leave. Done a lot of things while I was in the Marine Corps, so, you know, to pick an actual favorite moment is, there's been a lot of favorite moments. Boxing had a great impact because it was the, uh, the desire, the determination and discipline of the sport that made me want to be the very best that I could be. If we can continue this legacy on with Champions for Heroes, because there's many champions out there, you know, not just boxing champions, but champions of life. Mel has been able to honor his, his son, uh, you know, with the foundation. I thank the uh, uh, organization. I'm not deserving, but I'm humble. It's not the differences between the champions and the heroes, it's the similarities and how they always end up in the same place. When, they're, when they're, our fame is gone, we end up down, nobody around. The impact, the impact is, uh, I don't get through it without tears ever, um, especially in the hospital. Like when my buddy Angel Man Freddy walks in, they go, what are you doing here? And he says, to see you goosebumps roll because it, it changes their life what's left of it, the ones that are in the hospital. Gives them something to talk about. He told me once, he said, I'm always second. You know, he, he come in first once while well, he said, I don't be like you, Dad, you win. I said, I don't win always either. I said, you're 10 times the man I'll ever be. One of his requests, you tell my story. So he's getting it in his death.